Pretty exciting day here at East County Dish Education Center and Academy, right? My name is Greg Morrow from 115 The Hawk. We are proud to be your official media sponsor for the Stanley Cup's visit to the Quad Counties. The reason that we're here and the reason that the Stanley Cup is in your school this afternoon. Um, he is a professional scout with the Stanley Cup winning Chicago Blackhawks. He spent 15 years playing the game on a professional level. Grew up playing minor hockey in, uh, in Port Hawkesbury for the Straight Richmond Minor Hockey Association. He, uh, as far as a teammate goes, no more respected than this guy. Uh, you know, he did whatever it took to stand up for his teammates, and uh, nothing more honorable than the way he played the game, standing up for those teammates, and they appreciated, appreciated it. He was a leader on and off the ice. He wore the C in several stops during his 1,000 professional hockey games. And uh, he, he, you know, talking to him, he couldn't be more proud to bring the Stanley Cup home. There was no other place where he wanted to spend his day with the Stanley Cup. He's here with his son, Reese. Boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, from the Stanley Cup champion, Chicago Blackhawks, Frank Bill's own former NMSC student, Dennis Bondi. Foremost, I want to thank uh, everybody for coming. Uh, I know it's a big day because uh, it's a big day for me. So to be able to bring it back to my roots in my hometown and where I got my education, uh, which is very, very important. Everybody out there don't think it isn't. I want you to know that. Make sure you uh, pay attention to all your studies. But to be able to do this today and bring it back, there was no other option for me. I was coming here and going to where I played hockey in my uh, in Prospery and then back in Harvard Bushy where I grew up. So. Uh, Overall, this is a very, very uh, special and exciting day for everybody. Um, and all I want to say is make sure you continue. Uh, I'm just telling Mike, the guy who kind of takes care of the cup here, uh, this is my lifelong dream is to play in the National Hockey League. I didn't really tell anybody. That was what I wanted to do. I kind of kept that to myself, but I worked as hard as I could at it. And, and that goes for everyone, everybody out there. Adults right down in the students. If that's what you want to do, if you want to be a doctor, if you want to be uh, a lawyer, if you want to go out and play sports, uh, whatever you want to do, whatever your dream is, make sure you follow it. Uh, because if you don't follow it, uh, nobody else is going to help you do it. It's up to you to make sure you go out and take take charge and do whatever it takes to be successful. So, uh, and uh, if you give it your full effort and do what you can. Uh, at least you can look in the mirror the next day and say, you know what, I did the best I could and try to follow my dream. And that's what I did. I was lucky enough. So, uh, not being said on that, uh, it's, been a, it's been a great day and it's going to continue to be a great day going forward. To be able to do this is, uh, is a lifelong dream of mine. So, make sure you come up here and everybody smiles and gets a picture taken with it as, as the class and uh, enjoy, enjoy having it here. Okay, thank you very much. There's, uh, there's no doubt that today is a very special day uh, in this area, and because it's such a special day, uh, we had the warden of Antigonish County and AmeriCorps Hawkesbury declare today Dennis Bombay Day in the Quad Counties. And uh, here to say a few words on behalf of the County of Antigonish, the war warden, her glory. Thanks, Craig. Certainly my pleasure on behalf of Antigonish County to bring greetings. And Dennis certainly uh, true to the form and when he said never forget where you came from, what you can accomplish, and what your roots are. So today is Dennis Bombay Day and uh, certainly want to congratulate him on what he did for amateur sports, not only in this region, but right across Canada. And as I mentioned this morning on the Hawk, Dennis is certainly recognized from coast to coast in this great Canadian country that we do live in. So all the best of us. Uh, your Vice Principal, Daryl Brain. If you think of, if you're a grade 12 student, to think of the grade nines that are here, you know each other quite well. And, and for Dennis and I, uh, we put many, many hours of uh, time into hockey. 
uh, both on the community rates and the ponds and so forth. Uh, at that time, he always had a lot of dedication and determination. And uh, some of the other guys we played with are here as well at the back. Uh, guys like Rory's dad and, and some of the other uh, students here, some of their parents. And I think they'll all tell you that uh, he was certainly a very hard-working individual. And, uh, you, you know, when he came through, he had very supportive parents and a very supportive community. And also to realize that uh, he was not a lot different than many of us that are here today. Um, you know, he, he didn't know when he was your age what he was going to be when he grew up. Um, so he worked really hard, hard work, and an enjoyment of what he did. I say are probably the two key things that led to the very successful career, and it still continues to be a su successful career, and I congratulate him on that. Uh, and I was telling Dennis just the other night, uh, it's many of the older students and the adults that are extremely excited about this opportunity uh, because they know that this is something that really doesn't happen very often. Um, in my lifetime, this is the first time that I'm aware that the Stanley Cup has come into a school in our area. So we're really lucky and we really appreciate that he thought of us to come here and to visit and uh, to enjoy the experience of seeing uh, what the game is all about. Uh, but on behalf of the students and staff of East and Ganesh, uh, we have a small, two small presentations for Dennis. Uh, one is open up our appreciation for you attending here today. And uh, the other will come a little bit later this evening for Dennis. Uh, so the students, all the students that you see here today, uh, took some time this morning and everybody signed the back of the band presented at that time. So on behalf of the school, we'd like to thank uh, Mr. Bond for coming today. Hi, big guy. Come with daddy.